Yo, what's up guys? It's Bob Shelley, but you can call me Bob. Today, we're going to have two French mirrors that I played on the Dry Arabia. I want to play French. If you listen to my previous videos, I talk about why I want to play French. I really like cavalry. I like knights. They're my favorite units in Age of Empires 4. I like them in 2. I kind of really like longbows too, I'm not going to lie to you, because they're pretty cool. But, I don't know, there's something with knights. I just love them. I just love everything about knights. And French have the best knights. French was the first if I played. I did very well with them at first, but French is in a weird place right now. I feel like their best thing is feudal aggression, and their late game can be lackluster. And knights used to be so strong, but with the spear buff, like they're just not the same. So we're gonna look at two French mirrors I had where I played. I would say this opponent and I were very even, but the next game we will look at. Yes, we have two games today. The next game we look at, my opponent was much better than me, and this didn't go that well. So with this video, I'm also going to do something a little different. I'm going to have the whole map up because I kind of want to look at and see what my opponent, what my opponent did as well. He's a little faster off the gun, also by the way. Look at that, like a second fast. Like he's already a little bit faster. He's already killing the first sheet. My dudes are just chilling. So I gotta be. A little, I've been pretty sloppy with my openings, and I'll admit that. Uh, it's just even opening. So, with that being said, uh, before I start going with this game, I'm probably gonna try to go through these games a little bit faster because I'm trying to fit two videos or two games in the one video. And if you guys could please like, subscribe, comment, I would love it. I appreciate it. It, it helps me make those videos. I literally made this is the third video I'm gonna make today because I'm not sure when I'm gonna be able to make the next video. Probably maybe this weekend. What's today? Tuesday. So. I don't know, I might be able to squeeze one in another day this week. It's just I'm so busy with life and everything else. I had a little time today, so I just want to get these videos in. And it's including also just playing the games. Like, I, like you know, you play a handful of games that just aren't good, right? Like, I played an HRE game today, an HRE mirror. Another one, not the one of the video that was made yesterday or posted yesterday before this. Uh, I did another one where I just got four relics and the dude just left. And that was it. So, we're going to watch these videos. I'm going to go through them pretty quickly. And not quickly, but you know, it's gonna be at least two times speed, and we're gonna go from there. So, this guy opens with a scout. I just had to also open another scout as French. I feel it's pretty necessary. I you really need sheep, and let's see how my scouting is. I really like sending the first scout, I should be sending the first scout across the map, but I wanted the sheep. Maybe I should be going down there faster. And he goes to the right and left, it makes a lot of sense. Uh, I do remember a video came out that said this is where most of the sheep do sit. And he does, he's doing a great job with the sheep, and I feel like I didn't, he doesn't get any sheep here. Did I get any going down the middle? I did not. So that was like a really poor choice down there. There's really the only sheep that's left is like in his base. I think I was pretty good with everything else. One, so he has three here. He has five. Five. I grabbed one. There's at least some sheep stuck in the corners. Five. So he had five, and I sang another one. So we had two, we have three, and then here I have three. So we're actually pretty even on sheep. So routing didn't particularly matter that much. He puts four on gold, and I have, where is my gold, hello? I have three on gold at this point, and where are we? I mean, four on gold is too much for him, right? Like, he doesn't need that much gold. So I'm going to start mine before him. I think he opened, his opening was worse. He's just chopping the street off for some reason. That seems very inefficient. I'm actually gonna go four times here. So, and we're also just gonna build. So I have four of my cavalry. And it looks like he also has four. Okay, cool. Builds a house by his TC. I feel like as French, you don't want to do that because uh, that's good prime farming real estate as French. Uh, you don't really have any bonuses as farms. You don't really want to take them, but that's not great. And the reason why he's deciding to drop this tree down is because he wants to take this mill. Maybe this guy doesn't play a lot of French, but uh, they have cheaper economic buildings like mo like mill or mining camps and lumber camps, and that includes mills. So that wasn't super necessary by him. And what my opponent does decide to do here, he goes professional scouts. So that's definitely a little different. He pulls out the first unit I hear is a knight, and he still has two scouts. So what I decided to do is go archery range. That's like the thing is French. I thought it was a like cavalry, a school cavalry and archery range. But in the couple games I play, like, I feel like it hasn't happened. And when I've done it, even when it was meta, I just 
don't do great, I feel like. And look how defensive our guy is here at the minute. Like, he's getting a decent amount of wood. He's being very defensive. And I could, too. I have enough for it. I mean, I should be making archers. I should be making a second archery range. If he's going professional scouts, I actually totally don't punish this. And he gets to kill. Just sad. He gets the kill there. It is so bad for me. And I'm not getting a kill. And I'm trying to send this other paladin around. I say paladin. Other knight around to get that. And look at this. Getting that food. Oof. That's so good. Do not get the kill. I get zero kills. So we're behind in bills. I'm going to slow it down as I look at 25 bills for me. 5 military. 27 to 6. It's just not good already. You know. We're down 2 bills at the get go. This is a bad start. You really, it's really important to know that timing is coming and defend that initial timing. It's a solid little wall here, so I don't get like a cheap fill. I did know he's going for special scouts. Do my best to stop it. Kill a couple uh, scouts there. Do I lose another one? Get in there. Oh, nice. And I just can't get a knight in return. He's so good at just. Oh, I got one. Yes. I was gonna say he's doing so good at keeping his knights alive. Really big to get that knight kill there. I need food, so I'm forced to hunt, and it makes sense. Like this guy's very safe. Very safe in this hunt. And he just goes for blacksmith right now, and he has another stable. I am stable heavy. Like, if I open... <coughs> excuse me. Like, this is another vill. Oh, my gosh. And he, he does lose one knight for two vills. Probably still not worth it for him. But he's getting a better source of food. I'm not killing any vills. He kills this random archer I have over here for some reason. And he got the upgrade. Oh, jeez. Got the healing upgrade. What is the healing upgrade called? And he's... We're all over the map, by the way. This game was, this game was pretty wild. It is called Chivalry. I didn't know that when I was mostly a French player. This game was wild. I was microing all over the place, trying to get stuff done. I get two kills here. What are we? Thirty-seven vi villagers, twelve military, forty-three and twelve. So we're the same. I'm down five vills. That's how bad I was at defending, and I've done such a bad job in my games of defending. It's just really frustrating. Professional scouts help so much. Just taking that safe, safe food. He has his blacksmith, so as when he, when uh, as French, he actually gets a plus one attack automatically. And look how safe he is. Just building these towers. I talked about how like one of the previous videos is how good I was building. Oh my god! This all these vills dying, dude. What is going on? It's so frustrating. What am I doing? So. And I mean, and I know when I'm building this mill, these villagers are so exposed. These literally have to run over and be like, oh, juicy freaking villagers. I mean, I have some uh, some knights here. It's just like he's pretty well defended. Uh, just And I like a let him go three stables. Like, I don't have any spearmen. I should really go spearmen at this point. Like, just imagine if this was a barracks. It would be so much better. Instead, I'm just behind on knight production. Hey, I made one tower. Good job. Sorry about the on. Like I said, I'm tired. I'm trying to get through this. I I, I really apologize. Uh, but yeah, it's, it's so frustrating. And I don't even kill these guys. Like I get zero kills. And I'm trying to fight here. And look, as I'm there, counterattacks here. Oh, I see it. Like I see it coming. I was looking at my mini map. I've been pretty good about looking at my mini map at times. But I I need more. You know, I need to do a lot better at defending these. So we. Excuse me, so the mini-map, I bring my team back, or I bring my knights back to defend. I have a crap load of knights. I'm not even making archers. This is so useless, but, like, what am I going to make? So what I was kind of thinking as French, and what I, again, I, I referenced this in my previous stream, but BCQ was saying that you got to kind of be attacking from three different places. Like, I need to be attacking from, as he's attacking, like, kind of what he's literally doing, exactly what he's doing right here. Attack these villagers, attacking the, going here, and I'm forced to defend, and I'm trying to get in here. Try to get damage done, but it's hard. I mean, he can garrison 10 villagers in there. It's really, really hard. And this nice has been chilling here the whole time. I still don't have chivalry. He's been sitting there because there's no life. I still haven't got it. I I'm just pretty low on wood. I have a lot of food. I have really bad resource allocation. So I was just thinking how I'd really like to go. Oh my god, dude. How many villagers do I lose? Four. Oh my god. 44 vills to 56, 27 military guys. The game is just feels so over because of early losses. But this game is actually kind of long. Killing some of these stupid scouts. Ah, oh, jeez. He's so safe. No, I just lost so much more. Oh, my God. 
It could have been a lot worse, but it's still ugly. Oh, man. Is that ugly or is that ugly? Oh, it's just cringe to watch. Very cringe. And we even outnumbered over here. Run. Oh, trying to get away. I'm having trouble. Like I said, lots of microing was happening in this game. This guy's literally just watching me. Knows I'm here, and here they come. Oh, my God. I don't have a blacksmith yet, I don't think. Oh, I, I knew they were coming. Ran away. We knew it was coming. I was about to say, I really feel like I should have gone Fuel Age, but I couldn't. And I was just attacking the tower, of course. Gives him the notification. He can get away. I lose a knight, and I kill, like, maybe three vills. Cool. But at the same time, I'm having to fend up here. I've lost something here. Uh, I got some knights. Looks like I kind of won that battle. I have no blacksmith yet. Oh, this is awful. I tried to get these guys away. I think they died. Just think if I just went a little further too, I could have killed some of these guys. Like, ugh. So bad. And dude, the guy's on four freaking stables. And I don't blame him. But I should have went up. Now I'm not even close. Because I'm like, just so, so food starved. Like, I'm, I'm farming. Oh, good. Great. Farming and feudal. Farming is French. Just awful. Awful. Professional scouts helped him so much. Maybe worth getting in this matchup. It could be. I, I just... Ah, uh, it's so scary. If I was just, like, aggressive from the get-go, or, like, when Spears from the get-go, it would help so much. Uh, I got a couple kills here. Like, I just need to get damage done. I know how far I am behind him, but look at this dude. He's so good at building like, static defenses. I mean, we're around the same MMR. And we're same ELO. Oh, this guy finally died. Just chilling here the whole time. Dead. We're around the same ELO. Where... I think... I just gotta be better. I don't know if this type of towers would work. I really don't see people build this many towers. Like, it definitely keeps your guys safe from knights, but almost seems like a waste of wood. And I take... And it's just... If I could have actually got to the castle age where I was at that point in the game, I feel like I could have won. Like, I have way too much gold. Oh, jeez. It's just more dead villas, you know? And I definitely take this fight. And I thought I had this fight going into it. I still don't have upgrades. I still am a blacksmith. And he has melee defense. Like, his knights are just much better than mine. Oh, jeez. And I thought I had this fight at one point right here. I, I micro my units to move him here. I thought I had this fight. I have 15. He has 17. Huh. 13. 13, 10. That was close. I mean, I, I actually, the upgrades made a difference. I mean, he does get a little bit of reinforcements, but I genuinely think the upgrades made a difference in that fight. And still just... Where... I uh, spearmen like, eight years ago. I have 13 or wood. Really bad macro as well. Like, awful macro. Like, I'm trying to get farms down. Like, my macro is pathetic. Uh, just imagine if I had some spears mixed in that fight. It's just such an easy win. And I think I overtake him. Like, oh god, just make spears, man. It's just so frustrating watching this game. Actually, I'm just like so focused on one thing, and I just have no food. What are his what upgrades you have? And again, I just lose more bills. Like, bill count, 50, 50 army, fourteen military. It's uh, twenty-two military and sixty-four bills. He has fourteen villagers more than me. Hey, they have the spearmen, but I mean, and a blacksmith. I finally, finally get it. I realize it's important, but I'm 14 villagers behind. This guy is just taking better fights than me all the time. Every time he's taking better fights. Look at that response by him. So quick. Mm -mm -mm. I did get plus one melee defense, but it's just so way too late. I'm trying to think. Both the boars are over here. Really bad places for the boars. I guess they're kind of even, but kind of bad all at the same time. This guy, he's taking the berries. Look at all these towers. Oh, man. Played so much more defensively. I mean, it just shows. I, I really think if I got the Castle Age, I could have won this game. But I, I just didn't. Uh, we're just really trying to see what I could have differently. I want to see his mill upgrade. So I have wool barrel. I think I have fertilization too. I just click fertilization. I'll be really sad if he has both. He definitely has both, doesn't he? Didn't get fertilization. Okay. Whatever. Got fertilization. Did he get a... Did I get a... I got no wood upgrades. Did he get wood upgrades? Yeah, he did. He got one. Okay. I want to speed up a little bit. 
So I try to take try to kill those here, literally just attacking towers and doing other things. Hey, three spearmen can kill like uh, twenty one knights, right? Yeah. Oh, and there's more. Yeah. All right. Don't even kill that knight. Nice. And I lost a crap load of knights here because I wasn't paying attention. Oh my god. Uh. uh. This game makes me so sad to watch. I, I feel like I played it kind of poorly. I mean, it was fun to play, and even like you, we were talking after the game, like it was an exciting game. Like, like for us being fourteen hundred top thousand players, I feel like this was so micro intensive, just trying to get different things to happen, and it was a lot of fun. And I'm happy I did that because if I wasn't doing that, uh, I won't get better. So like, I literally have to do that. And the only way you can get better at multitasking is by literally doing it. And here we go. And I'm just kind of seeing up. There's more dead villagers. Don't tell me they die too. More dead villagers. Oh, jeez. Just so, so, so sad. I've lost spears now, though. But he definitely does too. He's definitely chilling with an army. Look at that. 23. Just so far ahead in villagers, and he's still just making feudal units. And I, I decided to go Castle Age because I kind of think that's the only way I can win. I really think that's the only way I can win. Really need more archers at this point. The archers would have helped. The skin picked off one by one. Ah, it just stinks so much. Out of gold, like my only goal is way over here, which I do find, and I do get to quickly. But look at that army. And he sees me as castle, like, he's not close, he's like, alright, we're fighting. <laughs> 66 villagers and 42 military, that's me. Wow. 77 and 69. So he literally has 27 more military, 66 villagers to 77. I'm only down 11, I feel like I caught up a little bit. I guess I killed some or he did a bad job in production. And maybe if I take a better fight here? Oh, uh, guys, guys, spearmen, there we go. I don't think it matters. I was going to say, maybe if I take a bird fight, it matters. This micro that so well. Where are my knights? I was trying to do damage. I'm just dying. I have veteran knights now, but... I don't really have any. Uh, I probably should have... My, I don't know. I was trying to keep him in his base, but it didn't matter. He made his decision to push. And as you can tell, just kind of overrun at this point. That was basically a 30-minute game of... Feudal fighting, which is fun. I thought it was pretty fun. And look, this does so well at the walls. Maybe I should have built walls. I don't know about that. I also like him going for Royal Institute. Why not? Near ahead, right? Upgrades will win the game, and I'm dying. So, um, before the screen comes up, I GG out of here. Probably basically as soon as he's Castle Age. There's only like 30 seconds left, so we're going to get out of this one. Uh, things that probably could have done better, like, just not lose so much is really the first thing that comes down to it. Like, I was just so behind on villagers, like, the whole time. It was not this game. I played a game as English, did not go well. Oh, well, I was HRE and he was English, and I got stomped. Uh, I could have played that game better, probably. It was weird. What one was it? This was, I was English and did not do well. I think it was Mongols, just, like, got overrun. I was like, okay... I'm not really sure how that game went so poorly, and I don't. We're not going to watch it. We're going to stay with the theme here, both these French games. But I just want to take a quick look here. I kind of caught up to this guy in villagers. Look at this. I killed a couple of vills, and he probably did a bad job producing vills. I almost came back in this situation, but my, I'm sure military at like 60 minutes was so bad. So it was like also a fight. I mean, there was a chance. There actually was kind of a chance in that situation. Just didn't get there. But and if we look at economy, I mean, more food, more wood, more gold, just really got me. I just kind of lost. And, and it's really because I lost so many villagers. It's really what it comes down to. It's minimizing losses. And I'll probably say this in so many videos. It's all about minimizing your losses. And the less you lose, the better you're going to do. So we're going to load the next game. It was this one? Yeah. This guy's eyes play. He was like 1580. So this guy's the highest player I've played. Uh, and honestly, it's going to be a lot of the same. Uh, a lot of multitasking. And we're going to see what he did. He opened barracks, like, ASAP. Which is strange. Very strange. Oh, wait, wait. Let's see, who, let's see how quick he is off the trigger. 
making a scout and a villager. And he's like right here. Oh, he's pretty slow. And he just does two bills on him. So he's faster, guys. Half speed. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. About the same, about the same. Cool. All right, two times. Let's we'll see where the scout goes. So I like to get the sheep around my base. I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna go straight to his side. He's going straight to my side. Okay. Oh, if I don't get that sheep, it makes me sad. There's always the sheeps. There's always the sheep around the front. Always the sheep showing around the front. There's also always oh, there's two here. And there's also always a sheep in the back. Always a couple sheep in the back. Good to get those. Very good to get those. So I have two here. I'm gonna get some here. Oh, he drills this, doesn't he? Oh, that sucks. I was right there too. I do grab one of his. I definitely grab this one, hopefully, from him. Oh, do I miss that one? Oh, sad. I... And actually, we saw, like, some mind games. You didn't see it. But uh, I'm going to pause real quick. So his scout was coming right here. So when we met here and we saw each other, he actually beelined it for the back. And I, like, dropped off here knowing he came from here and saw him going that way. I was like, and I haven't been over this way yet. I was like, I need to get over here. I know there's sheep over here, which I do think there's only one, which is... Meh. One sheep. Sometimes these games, like, having sheep, like, it's not going to win or lose you the game, but it's going to help you. The sheep wars are important. It's important to think where their scout is not going. And he's not getting anything if he goes over here. He might get this one. But I go over here in the corner. I get these ones in the corner. Sheep game, I kind of think we're kind of even. Is he going to walk right into the other one? Where was it? That's oh, right there. Now he missed it. And we both missed this one. Oh, I just got it. Okay. Let's see what the sheep count is, though. Oof. Six there. So he has one left under his TC. Two here. So he has eight. I returned some of mine. Maybe I'm, like, returning too many. So I return. So we have... Okay, there's none left. And I have two, four, six. I kind of think we're semi-even with sheep. Oh, even. And here he is. Look how much wood he's getting early. He's... French. Look at that. It's a lot of wood. That's a lot of wood to take early as French. Kind of surprising. I mean, I... Oh, I also was like, my resource allocation this game was so bad. I had like six villagers on gold at one point. Like, what am I doing? Just didn't start this game out very well for playing like a guy that's going to be like, you know, the highest I played. And he only did four. I probably should have did four. I did five because I thought I was really far behind. And I wasn't. And I should have done four. I'd much rather have that res that villager collecting resources than anything else. So, and here we go. He builds his barracks right after this. And I don't love building stuff next to the downside of the French. You can use this for farms. I really don't. And look at him. He's just grabbing it. He's just defending early. He's like, I'm here to defend. And I'll make a knight at the same time. But he doesn't have much... Many more resources to do anything else. Hmm. Do you get a villager kill? Oh, I was feeling good. Like, hell yeah, man. Does he get a villager kill? No. Get in there. Get in there. Oh, God. It's so hard. When you're far away, it's so hard defending us that first night. I can't get the kill there. Two spearmen. I can't fight into that. And he has two spearmen here. He's just making some spearmen. And he's not upgrading. I kind of like that. You don't need veteran spearmen. Or wait. Oh, he did upgrade? Pause. I definitely saw Seville here, probably. Yep. Corpse. God, I'm probably going to lose that one too. How freaking pathetic. Okay. Is he another barracks? Wait, why is it? Okay, so he did get a hardened spearman. I'm very confused because when it's coming out, like the button only has one. Okay. It only had one little dot above it when they normally has two if they're hardened. But right here it has two. Okay, very thrown off there. I apologize. All right, so knights a little spread out. I grabbed chivalry pretty early in this game, and I got double range. Like I'm like, all right, this dude got some spurs, man. I'm going double range. Ah, dude, how do I lose this game? And he's saving his gold. Look at this, saving his gold, going horseman, going horseman. Did my opponent see? I wish. Ah. I wish I could fix that. It's really frustrating. Like I, I want to know what he saw. It's like educational too. It's something where like needs to really fix in the replays. 
It's really, it's just kind of annoying. Like, it's for educational purposes. Hey, is this guy responding with horsemen because he saw double range and know he doesn't need that? Like, I don't know. Very frustrating. And then he falls off with another stable. With the one Rax. Hmm. Hmm. Very interesting. And I have one stable. I really... And I want professional scouts this game too, by the way. I remember last game my opponent professional scouts. It felt pretty good. I mean, I'm getting a lot of food. But what, we're already in villagers right now. One knight here. Kill this knight. Feels good. This is a solid pickoff. So 35 to 23. That's my opponent. Oh my god. 30, 35 to 23. 34 to 14. I have a lot of food, and this this was, I don't know what's happening here, this was really annoying. I could be producing a lot more archers. I really could be. I feel like my archer production was really bad. I could use more on wood. Five on wood wasn't good here. This is like way too much food. I didn't need this much food. It was just bad. Ah, just like watching this game right now, I feel like if I just made more archers, and have more on wood, like I win. Like I don't like if, if I'm going through ranges, I don't need 17, 16 on food. I really needed like a lot of those on wood. Just imagine if I have like I could have like I don't know, like eight more archers. It's so bad. Like I get and he I mean he commits like the two like two stable, two racks in production, but thirteen. Thirteen horsemen versus and I didn't see this coming by the way. 13 horsemen and where are my knights? Do I really not have like any knights? Where are my knights? I have no idea where they are. I apologize for the steam message. We're just gonna ignore that it happened. Oh god. That's so frustrating. Where are my knights? And this I'm sure we all know how this ends. This is actually a freaking game freaking losing right here. I have two knights that's doing damage here. How you feel in the middle of the game when all <laughs> like nine archers die? Did these guys die too? Some half health villagers, like I don't know. Dude, where are my knights? Like I just feel like my macro is so crap. Both games crap macro. This losing villagers left on the right. I did kill some of these guys' villagers. Like we're close from villagers, forty-two villagers. As I lose more. 41 villagers to 44 like God. these French mirrors I'm doing a bad job of dishing I'm doing a horrible job of the oh my doing a horrible job of defending awful job holy hell hey at least I have uh, eight more archers to send to their freaking deaths I mean I have knights like they're just so much better than horsemen like they have like so much more life so much more damage. It's not even using the spearmen, it's defending with them. It's really smart. I. What are they doing? Fight, man! Where are you going, dude? I lost more in that fight, by the way. Like, I really feel like I should not lose more in that fight. I feel like I should have the superior units in general. Like, this dude doesn't have like that much gold. It's not like he's going to the third age. He's just going in the knights now, and he's triple stable. Barracks, like, dude, what the, f what the heck, you know? And get him, Wolf. Ah, uh, it's just so frustrating to watch. I'm sorry, I was very frustrated with myself to seeing this. Just kill these dudes, man. Just crush them. So, trying to I'll go out here, professional scouts. He's smart. He, he knows how professional scouts. Just chilling, just chilling. Trying to get some kills there. Oh, when I say get kills, I meant my units to die. Uh, he's getting wheelbarrow. I just got wheelbarrow, so we're both getting these upgrades. And oh my god, just not minimizing losses. Really, just losing maximum at all times. 
I see him here. Please drop it. Please drop it. He's gonna kill these two. He's trying to chase him. Run, Scouts. Please. Please just get away. For me. No. We're trying to juke. Run. Run. These are all his units. Scouts, please. Just leave my scouts alone, dude. They're just trying to get some deer. We have hungry villagers, dude. I finally go racks, but it's just like, why Why go racks? I probably should just double down on archers. Trying to get some damage in down here. Did he even kill a villain? I mean, he only had like four spearmen. Could have done something. Oh, hey, there's another knight dead. That's fine. Oh, we're trying to get away. Look at these low life guys. Oh, you like that? That was a sick move. I wish I could rewind. That was a cool move, guys. Okay, that was a sick move. You didn't see it because I was going too fast. So, you could rewind the YouTube video because I was looking in the general area when it happened. But basically what happens was I had these four knights. I run these three away. Take the full health one. Turn the full health one back around because I saw when I was playing, I saw these guys had two, both had low life. Okay, come in. Shwam! Dead. Shwam! Dead. Okay, that felt really good. Okay, like, as things as, as bad as, like, a lot of things want this game. Oh, yeah. That was such a good move, man. Like, I was really proud of myself. Like, I'm definitely watching this right now. I'm like, oh, yeah, bro. You're freaking dead. Nah, nah, nah. I'll take the horseman, though. I'll take the horseman, though. Oh, but he's Castle Age, and we're not that close. Great. No. No, it's not worth your life! And I look away immediately. I can't watch him die. Dead. Uh, run? Uh, I probably... No. Jeez. Ah, dude, this dude's dying left and right. Like, oh my god, he's in Castle Age. We're not close. Ugh. Not even close. So I have a market? I just did. I just, I, I sold, I had so much extra gold, I just sold up for Castle Age. Let's go. Trying to mass some spearmen, like it's gonna make, give, make a difference. And, oh, jeez, I was trying to get these, just one deer, man. I made some scouts get one deer and this kills me. And I lose two more knights, dude. He just picked me apart, like, military-wise. 55 villas, 58 villas. Like, we're kind of close in villas, but 28 military to... 28 military to 43? Like, ah, I just lost so many. I just couldn't... Uh, I don't know what the hell these guys were doing. Like, why? Why were all my villagers over here? I can't tell you. I really can't tell you why the hell I had like 12 villagers running over there. When the game, I was like, there ought to be a reason they're over there, right? Nah. Nah, there was real no reason. I mean, they're my gold villagers. Like, I, I don't know where I was telling them to go. And these, this got picked at so many times. These archers are useless. Try to get some kills here. Like, I'm multitasking. Some, some spears here. Uh, and when I say multitasking, I mean multi dead villagers. It's like, how many freaking villas just died, dude? One, two, three, four, five, six. Well, we're falling apart, man. We're falling apart. I said, oh, there's multitasking. We just fall right apart, dude. Maybe you spear me again. Just maybe. Just maybe. I have this two times this game. I'm, I'm just so disgusted, you know? I'm so dejected. Look at all the dead villas, man. These French mirrors. Oh, and he has veteran royal knight. Cool. Oh, so do I. Well, loser. I do too, bro. You make nothing. It's taking food too. Did you get fertilization? He did not. Did I get fertilization? I've been pretty good about getting it. I'm getting it right now. Okay. Look at this. He has such a big army. I'll get you. I'll get you with my ten spearmen. I'm surprised he runs away. Oh, just look at this. Ah, it's so annoying. And you're over here. Now I'm over here. I did such a bad job stack defenses. Like, I should have, like, wall. Maybe this wall. This wall would have helped. Just wall. Build walls. I mean, that's something. Build some type of defense. Defensive structures. I built none. I'm trying to get some, some damage done here, but... God, this is like Ville. Let's try and get some more down here. I'm trying to get something here. I'm trying to just do whatever I can. I'm trying to attack myself. I thought I was defending up there. I have some spears here. He has literally these dudes sitting in a corner. He has some guys here fighting my guys. I mean, this game was crazy. We're all over the place in both these games, but it's just 
not enough. Like, he's so smart. Like, his tag defense being spearmate is kind of interesting. Like, it's very good. It's very good against, like, that one or two knights, too. Mm. He built a monster here, but he didn't get any relics. Probably not. All right, speed up. So, I mean, I'm defending, but, like, I'm so many bills behind. You know what I did do? Did I do it? Oh, yeah. Building a second TC. I mean, I know I'm behind so many bills. I have 47 bills. I have less. I have less bills now than when we looked last, okay? And he has 69. Nice, dude. Nice. Freaking loser. 69 bills. Okay. He's getting stoned. Jeez. All right, speed it up. Speed it up. Let's get it over with. Wrap it up. Wrap it up. Wrap it up. Try to get crossbowmen. Like, why don't I need more archers? Let's get some crossbowmen. Might as well. Get some more spears. Let's get vil double vills. Like, I mean, I'm trying. Like, I think the only way back into it is <laughs> double TC and this dude just castle drops me right in my face. Tower drops me. I was kind of thinking, do you know what's disgusting? He's so far ahead that if these 17 villagers died, I have 55. Or I have 55. Like, he'd be tied in villagers. He, <laughs> he might be one up still. He, he's literally this far ahead in villagers. And I, I was like, alright, I, I might be able to take this fight. Like, he's kind of taking a bad fight, I thought. Like, alright, you're fighting on my TC. But, like, the re where's my army, man? Where Where is it? Up here they are. Useless archers doing what? How much damage? Three. Dead units. I mean, they're kind of low. I said GG. I'm out of there. I just wanted out. I mean, I had no chance. He had more horsemen. Like, I mean, he could have brought stuff and I died. The stuff was kind of low, but I mean, it was over, let's be honest. It was a rough game. He was better than me. He's a lot better than me. It's just so frustrating. These games were hard to watch. Just these losses were hard to watch, guys. They really were. But that's the point of, point of these videos. Like, what can we learn to do better? And, like, the biggest thing is minimizing losses, maybe building a tower, or just doing something. Like, zero defense. Like, something that both guys did was do defense. But they did it in very different ways, which is really cool. One dude used Spearman, playing against French, knowing I'm going to go Knights. Like, hey, I'll throw some Spearman here, and that'll be my defense. Which is cool, because you can utilize those to actually attack, or utilize them later. I kind of really like that idea. Uh, where me, on the other hand, I literally did nothing ever. Different game, same damn problem. It's very frustrating. You got close to villagers again. It's just so many. So many die. Look at the military count too. That was where's the, where the archers die? Is that here? Must be here. And then just none of these fights go well. Wow, it's so frustrating. Look at this food. So much more food. Like I somehow have more wood. Not doesn't even matter. I need the wood early in the game, not late in the game. It's got really crushed. And I'm sad about it. Bad, bad games. But that's why we're here. We're here to learn from the losses. Even learn from the victories. I like showing the victories. Personally, I'd rather show us victories. I have more fun showing my victories. Like, oh, I did this wrong, but I still won. Hey, 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 hey. didn't work out well. That's okay. We're learning. I want my French to be better. I feel like French is just like the generic sieve that's all around decent that I want to be better. I should probably get my, Eng my English win rate is awesome, but I feel like I'm just not, I'm so, I've been playing so much Avacid that it's just so hard. And I have been liking HRE. My HRE win rate is pretty garbage, but I feel more comfortable with HRE than I do with uh, English and French. And something cool, if you look at HRE win rates in the lower divisions, it's very low. But actually, in 1600 and above, it's the the third highest besides Delhi and Mongol. Go figure. And it's really because, and this is what I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say this, and I'm going to leave. But HRE, and I know it's not really on top of the video, but HRE, HRE win rate is so much better in other brackets. And I'm not saying, I don't know for sure, but if I had to take a guess, is because they're the best at doing fast castle at a good time. And that's what makes sense to me, where lower ranked players, and, and something else, they defend well. They will defend attacks well, where lower ranked players just won't do that, and they'll lose. So, that being said, I'm out. I will. This video will upload on Wednesday the 23rd. I'm going to have it come out, 
and then I'm going to hopefully get a game in. There's a Steam. Something soon. But we'll see. All right, guys. I'm done. Bye bye. Oh, remember to like, follow, show some love, subscribe. All right, peace.